Well, good morning. It's the uh, first day of March. Uh, I was sitting there trying to think of what topic I wanted to work on today, and uh, the word kept coming up, uh, motivation. Um, we all have motivation. Uh, sometimes it feels like we don't. But even if we have the motivation to do nothing, that's still motivation. Um, things that I've tried to do is to change my motivation uh, for the positive. Um, we can get stuck in negative motivation, which, like I mentioned prior, you know, the motivation to do nothing. Um, if, if we have the motivation to do nothing, then we become stagnant and stuck in a rut. And uh, I heard some good things about that last night at a, a meeting I went to about motivation and uh, not getting stuck or becoming stagnant. You know, even out here right now, this is just motivation. Um, I, I've made a goal that I'm going to climb that mountain one of these days, and I can't wait to try it. Um, you'll hear more about it as I get closer to doing it. Motivation comes in many forms. Sometimes our lives get in such a turmoil that we're motivated to try to find peace and balance. And uh, that motivator is a positive one, of course. Um, not that I have anything against the lottery or gambling or anything like that. It's not my thing. But uh, like a negative motivator I could see is like, like playing the lottery so you can get more money. Uh, more money doesn't equal happiness. Uh, I know a lot of people say that, but it, it's the facts. And sometimes it, uh, it brings more more uh, trauma to the situation than, than comfort. Those are two very strong words. You know. See, my motivation for getting sober is the fact of, you know, not having any kind of comfortability within myself. Um, I'm very uncomfortable in the situation in life I was in, my station in life, as, as they say. Um, I wasn't productive. I could just barely take care of myself on a daily basis. Um, my needs weren't met, you know, the basic needs of humans. Uh, Everything outside of that is, is luxury. And, uh, you know, that's, that's another part of this motivational thing is that, you know, know what is positive, what's irrelevant, and what's negative. Keep those in mind because it's, it's wise to know what's the best Thing for you. So I guess this started out as motivation and kind of worked into uh, being positive, which is not a bad thing. Uh, know your motivators. Chase after the positive. Ground out the negative. Um, and once again, let me throw this in here. You work with a higher power of sorts. You know, have have him distinguish the two because just because something looks negative doesn't mean that it's going to be when it happens it'll happen remain in the present uh, because you know what we're not headed towards the past don't look at the past I mean use them as lessons but always keep your eyes forward and on the prize until next time Keep your head up.